And to kick off, of course, Dead Space came out last Friday and it's done very well. A lot of people's reviews have been absolutely fantastic. And I have to say, it is looking brilliant. But, of course, we saw Callisto Protocol also come out last year. That didn't do quite as well. Um, and it's actually... Dead Space has actually almost doubled the players on Steam as well, which is an interesting one. So after years of making a hype and budget reportedly around 160 million, the Callisto Protocol's highly anticipated launch in December underperformed with lower than expected scores from critics, mixed reviews from gamers, and it peaked at only 17,000 players on Steam. Now, the remake of Dead Space has been so much better received, I'll tell you that now. Positive feedback from fans and a peak of 30,000 players on Steam. Now, I think on console, it's probably gonna be a little bit more, because I think, personally, I think to experience Dead Space in particular, console's great, but PC works, but I think console really, really kind of puts you on with the twin stick kind of movement and all that kind of stuff. But it is one of those things. Callisto just did not do too well. But we're going to have a little bit of a chat about it now. I'm joined with Matt Simpson on the show Hello. again. Thank you for joining me, Matt. As nice always, yeah. It's nice to be on this side rather than your side of the thing when you when you decide to swan off somewhere else for a bit. I know. Did you um, catch him? I bet you, you, you Well, hope, hopefully, you know, didn't do too badly. Um, but yes, so uh, rather than you interviewing me, I thought for once... I can interview oh, you about it. Oh, he's got his notes, everybody. He's all right. Um, Look at him. My favourite thing about it is there is absolutely nothing written <laughs> down on this. Um, I just do, it's just a prop effect. That's it. Um, but you have been playing the Dead Space remake. I have. Uh, you yeah. started yesterday. Tell me what you think so far. Really good. So the graphics look fantastic. Um, already the storyline is being stuck to, which I was heard a lot about, so I was hoping that that was the case. The scares and the atmosphere is absolutely there. Um, it looks great. You know what? I think it's not buggy because I was worried it was going to be a bit buggy. Um, I, I, haven't, I haven't got any complaints so far. I've only played like the first hour and a half of the game, but it's, it's enjoy I'm enjoying it. What are you seeing that's different from the... You've played the original, I right? I have played the original, So yeah. what's, what, what are the main differences that are standing out to you at the moment? I mean, I haven't really noticed any, if I'm honest. Oh, really? Um, not too many. I mean, the, the necromorphs look spot on. I think mm. the necromorphs look really real this time around, though. I mean, they looked really good in, in the 2008 version, but like, I don't know, there's something a little bit creepier about them this time, and yeah. I just don't know if it's because the enhanced graphics make them a little bit more intense. Mm. Not too sure. I actually find, though, the gameplay is actually a little bit harder. I don't know what, I'm only, I'm only playing on medium, guys, because I'm just <coughs> settling myself in, do you know what I mean? Yeah. But um, I do find, like, you know, the game, in terms of, like, I just think when you play a remake, I found it with Resident Evil as well, though, I just find, like, the monsters come at you a little bit hardcore. So it's a little bit more like, oh, a little bit, but yeah. And you... Um and you've played the Callisto Protocol as well, uh -huh. like, and I know that you were yeah. really excited about that. I was, I was. Um, but I believe you're, you generally didn't like that very much. No. So why? How come? I, don't know how come? I mean, like, I didn't want the, I didn't want the reviews to take me because I'd read the reviews and I was like, you know what, I'm not going to listen to the reviews because I want to experience it for myself. So I played it, and the the one thing that I did read before I did play it was about the new combat with the, you know, dodging and all that kind of stuff. And I was like, oh, it can't be that bad. But when I did play it, it's so janky and it's so boring. And I think it's just that you're going into these areas. The atmosphere is actually great. Like they, they, they've created a very dead space, very like creepy atmosphere, like, like they do in dead space. But I just feel like it's repetitive and you could just die so easily. You can't really, I don't know, you one move and you can just get, you did, you're dead. Mm. And I just don't find that very fun. Um, and it's just, you know, it's just so repetitive. There's just yeah. nothing to it. So. When you say repetitive, do you mean the gameplay itself? Is the it gameplay. Like you're looking for more, what, enemy variety, level variety? What's Definitely what's enemy variety, because mm. you, you're going into an area, and because with, with like games like Dead Space and like Callisto, I mean, you're in the same kind of environment for a long time, so you've got to find a way of switching that up and making it quite exciting, but Dead Space do that. In this new game, you can clear an area and you could go back and it's going to be full of monsters again. It doesn't guarantee your safety, which puts me very on edge, which is great for a horror game. But with Callisto, you're going through and you're going in the area and it's just so samey and there's nothing that really mixes it up. And I think, you know, it's a shame because they've obviously taken so much from Dead Space into Callisto with like the stomping and, you know, you have to stomp your enemies to get you your ammo and all that kind of stuff. But yeah, you just didn't quite do it for me, but Dead Space has done well. So, so. you don't. So you think these numbers make a lot of sense in terms of you know the fact that Dead Space has proved 
well, basically twice as popular. On PC, so it's a bit different. Yeah, but, PC yeah. is different. I think I personally would say it's better to like, you know, do it on console and experience it on console. But I think, yeah, I think people weren't sure with the reviews and when people played it, I just think the word's gone round and people are like, I'm not going to play Callisto, I'm not going to pick it up. So, which is, you know, it's a shame for the, for the makers. They spent a lot of money on it. So Yeah, I think, yeah. I think I'm going to, I think I definitely think I want to try Dead Space. I'm not really a fan of horror games, but uh, I think I'll definitely want to You should, it. honestly. It's brilliant. It's Defi so good. Definitely want to give it a go. I definitely want to, um, yeah, but anyway, we're going to move on now to... Oh, that's your bit. <laughs> Look at him, he's trying to steal my show, guys. One day you're going to see Sorry. him. Sorry! going to be sat in this seat forever. 